Hello everyone, this is Ariane Arsenault. I am freshly back from New York City. Last week, I was all week at the YouTube space in New York as I was selected as part of the winners for the YouTube Next Up Creator Camp class of 2017. Look at this cool jacket. It has the YouTube next up on it and my name on the back, Ariane Arsenault. I have my very own YouTube jacket now. How cool is that? I want to do a quick video of my stay at the YouTube space in, in New York and I will comment through the video, show you some footage. I'm sorry, it may be a little bit uh, wonky as I'm not a vlogger. I hope the audio is good, but I really, really wanted to let you know what I did last week as it was an amazing opportunity and it was so awesome. So here we go, day one. Hey, it's my first morning in New York and I am on my way with some of the Next Stop class participants and we are walking to the YouTube space. On my way, excited. I decided to walk to and from the YouTube space every day to get some fresh air before uh, spending the rest of the day inside. Then we had to grab our badges and head into the Studio A, which was our main meeting area every morning, where we had a pep talk with Caitlin, our YouTube partner manager. Then the staff at the YouTube space took us for a tour of their many studios, which was quite impressive. On Monday, we had the time for a camera technique class with Corey, which was with a pretty big camera that I probably will never use again. And then I had the pleasure to meet Chris and Taylor that would later turn out to be our mentors for the week. Um, we talked a little bit about the camera techniques that we had just seen, and then we were granted a cool activity as we were taken to the paint shop and everyone got to paint their own New York skyline. Some of us went a little wild while others like me not so much. Really early on the morning of the second day I decided to join Craig and Nate from the run experience for a sunrise run in Central Park. You can see by the color of my skin tone that I am not a runner but I just couldn't miss this opportunity. It's 6 a.m. and I am in Central Park. I went out for a run with the Run Experience YouTube channel. We were up at 5 this morning and um, I just let them go because they're runners and I'm not. But I had about a 15 minute run in the park and I'm just going to keep on walking because it's the sun rising and it's beautiful. <laughs> Tuesday was definitely our biggest day. We had class all day. The first one was a lighting class, so we were shown how to create different lights environments using low budget and high budget equipment. It was really interesting to see as I am working on this at the moment. Then we had an audio class where we were shown different equipment. Again, some that are things that I think I can use and others that I know I will never have the budget. Then we went into a green screen class, which was pretty awesome. I felt like a child <laughs> stepping into the screen in and out. And then we had the editing class for the green screen and my brain was pretty dead at that time and it was time to go back to the hotel. After an inspiring session with film director Vincent Pion on Wednesday, we got together in Studio B with our team members and mentors and got a little crazy on stage finding a name for our team. Later on Wednesday night, we Ubered over <laughs> to the NBC studios where we all got to sit and listen to a workshop about um, social media and YouTube strategies for uh, us next uppers and then we got a little crazy and um, went on air at the NBC studios where we got to play tourist and got to create a little clip in the studios so everyone was assigned a role I was in the rock and roll band pretending to play percussions and other instruments. <laughs> Thursday was our big day in the studio where we had to shoot all of our team members week assignment video into the Studio B. We were all each other's crew and I was assigned lighting. As surprisingly, I was told I was good at it. <laughs> 
Not much free time, but I got to sit with Craig and Nate in the cool orange rubbery couch. I am about to go in the Studio B to do my assignment today. We all had an assignment to shoot during the week and I'm up next. I decided to work on a soap maker's interview of how I got started and if you'd like to take a look at it, it's already up in my YouTube channel. On Friday, we all had to edit our video so it would be ready for viewing later that night. It was one of my biggest challenges because I had never worked with Adobe Premiere prior to that week. I have to say, it never took me so long to edit a three-minute video. <laughs> When we returned to Studio A at 5, we were all given our awesome YouTube jacket as well as a YouTube goodie bag. Everybody took a seat in the studio. There was popcorn, snacks, chocolate, a bottle of champagne may have been opened. Uh, <laughs> and so we toasted to our amazing week and got ready to watch everybody's week assignment. I didn't shoot the videos, uh, but I will link them below so you can take a look. Oh, if you ever go to the YouTube space New York, look for my autographed picture on the YouTube wall of fame as I am up there now. Hot beats, hot beats, hot beats, I don't know if the like the vegetable. <laughs> yes, my team was pretty hot, but it was the last day, so it was time to say goodbye to the YouTube space. Everybody was taking uh, last minute pictures with everyone. But uh, the YouTube staff had one last surprise for us. It's Friday, it's the last day of Next Up and everybody's going to a party and the place is empty. I can't remember the name of the bar we went to, but all I remember is that it was filled with giant size board games and I got to play giant Jenga with my friend JK from Koali Pops who had the bright idea of having us play with our eyes closed. It was something I had never done before, but it was tons of fun. Then. The evening was coming to an end and it was our last one, so I took my camera out and started taking pictures with everyone. Goodbyes makes me feel sad and I wanted to take home as many happy memories as I could as this was really the last night. I am finally in Times Square. I never thought I was going to make it, but thanks to Marissa and JK who tagged along with me. <laughs> I was able to make it. Yay! I'm glad I have some great friends to take me along with them in New York, eh? Otherwise I would be totally lost. Same, same, <laughs> same. This is New York City. Just out and about and visiting New York, we are heading out to Central Park. And just like that, the week was over. I am taking many souvenirs back with me. I got also a few gifts from the team at the YouTube space. I want to give a big thank you to everyone at the creator camp that were part of the organization. We were totally spoiled and well taken care of. The class was amazing. I also want to thank all the other creators that I had the pleasure to meet during that amazing week. And lastly, but not least, I want to thank you, my subscribers, because without your support, I wouldn't have been able to apply for this opportunity in the first place. So thank you very much. I will link um, a couple of the videos from the people in my team, the Hot Beats, if you'd like to see at what they've been working on when they were at the YouTube Space New York. And that's it for today. I will see you later in a more bubbly video. <laughs>